Imagine, if you will, a tapestry woven from stardust and azure canvas strewn with brush strokes of 10 billion lights. Each twinkling dot is a sun, shining with its own story, a silent orchestra of creation and buzzing tale of mystery. Tonight, we begin a cosmic voyage, a celestial waltz through the ten suns beyond our familiar solar waltz. First, we set off for Proxima Centauri, the whispering neighbor just a stone's throw away in the cosmos. A red dwarf, it harbors the secret in its gravitational embrace, Proxima B, a rocky world dancing in the twilight of its habitable zone. Can the whisper of life echo there, born on the solar wind? Proxima Centauri's house distance is 4.24 light years, closest star to Earth, planet 2 Proxima B is in the confirmed, habitable zone. Age 4.85 billion years old. Location, Constellation Centaurus. Interesting fact, home to the closest known, potentially habitable exoplanet. Next I set eyes on Ross 128, a sun with a youthful glow on the cosmic calendar, barely a teenager. Two planets pirouette around it, a shy ballerina called Ross 128b, hiding the possibility of life. Does he still hold the secrets of the blooming universe? Ross 128, distance, 11.09 light years. Planets, two confirmed, Ross 128 be potentially habitable. Age, 5.4 billion years old. Location, constellation Cetus. Interesting fact, first potentially habitable system discovered with two transiting planets. At number three is the Wolf 359. Wolf 359, a sun with a fiery temper, once shone in a spotlight that rivaled the moon. But within its restless embrace, can the planets whisper tales of resilience forged in the crucible of stellar fury? Wolf 359, distance, 7.85 light years. Planets, none confirmed yet, but a candidate planet has been identified. Age, 1.6 billion years old. Location, constellation sextons. Interesting fact, known for the 1994 flare that briefly became the brightest star in the sky. Number 4 Tau Ceti Tau Ceti's steadfast hand, the sun of golden maturity, presides over a celestial court of five. Some whisper for life to be sheltered, others shrouded in icy silence. Does Tau Ceti hold the key to the diversity of planetary life, a cosmic library untold in the world? Tau Ceti, distance, 11.9 light years. Planets, 5 confirmed, possibly within the habitable zone. Age, 5.8 billion years old. Location, constellation Cetus. Interesting fact, a G-type star like the Sun, making it a prime target for exoplanet searches. Epsilon Eridani, the young prodigy, a Sun just emerging from its stellar diaper, yet already clothed in a swirling skirt of debris. Is it the messy workshop of creation, where planets are sculpted from dust and dreams? Epsilon Eridani, distance, 6.5 light years. Planets, three confirmed, one potentially habitable. Age, one billion years old. Location, constellation Eridensis. Interesting facts, young, active stars with a debris disk indicate possible planet formation. Tea Garden Star, the cosmic underdog, a sun so dim it's almost hidden yet holds two small worlds in its gentle grasp. Are these whispers of resilience proof of life's tenacity in the face of cosmic dimness? Tea Garden Star, distance, 12.5 light years. Planets, two confirmed, small and rocky. Age, 8 billion years old. Position, Aries. Interesting facts, discovered in 2014, it is one of the smallest and faintest known host planet stars. Luton BC, the celestial waltz trio, is a symphony of three suns locked in a gravitational embrace. And between them, the three planets pirouette bathed in the twinkling light of their cosmic ruler. Do they dance to unknown rhythms, evidence of the universe's fondness for the unconventional? Luton BC, distance, 12.9 light years. Planets, three confirmed, all probably terrestrial. Age, unknown, but estimated to be billions of years old. Location, constellation Cetus. Interesting fact, first triple star system discovered to host planets in its habitable zone. GJ357, the red dwarf pioneer, is a sun that ventured into the habitable zone with a rocky companion. Does it tell a story of courage, the courage to step into the unknown and cherish life in the twilight? GJ357, 
Distance, 31 light years. Planets, 3 confirmed in a habitable zone. Age, 2.3 billion years old. Location, constellation Hercules. Interesting fact, one of the first systems discovered with a planet in the habitable zone of a red dwarf star. 47 Ursa Majoris, the celestial family gathering, a sun with two possible shelters for life, is located between a trio of siblings. Is this the key to the family dynamics of the stars, the competition and cooperation that shape the fate of the planet? 47 Ursi Majoris, distance, 39.5 light years. Planets, three confirmed, two potentially habitable. Age, 7.1 billion years old. Location, constellation, Ursa Major. Interesting facts, multiple potentially habitable planetary systems discovered using the transit method. And finally, Kepler 186f, Earth's cosmic twin, a distant sun that reflects our own blue marble. Does it stare back at us with an echo of familiarity, a silent question hanging in the void? Are we alone? Kepler 186f, distance 500 light years. Planets, 5 confirmed, Kepler, 186F inhabitable zone. Age, 4.6 billion years old. Location, asterisk, asterisk, constellation Cygnus. Interesting fact, first Earth-sized planet discovered in the habitable zone of another star. 10 suns, 10 stories, 10 whispers in the grand symphony of the universe. A testament to the boundless creativity of each universe, its capacity for both fiery drama and quiet contemplation. As we journey into these heavenly mysteries, let us remember that we are not mere observers, but threads woven into the tapestry of creation. Our journey is but a verse in the epic poem of the universe, a poem that whispers of possibilities yet unimagined, waiting to be discovered in the light of billions of suns. So, dear viewers, raise your gaze to the heavens, let the starlight paint your dreams, and remember, we are not lost in a billion suns. We are explorers, storytellers, and visionaries, forever dancing to the rhythm of the cosmos.